DSA stands for Deep Seek Sparse Attention, and it was introduced by Deep Seek in V3.2 experimental model. Now, DSA is a really big deal because when the size of the context window grows, its computational cost doesn't grow literally, it grows quadratically. Now, DSA does this using a two-step process. First, it has something called a lightning indexer, and the lightning indexer determines the most relevant tokens of all the previous tokens up until this point. And then it passes it into something called the top K token selector, and that keeps only the top 2048 tokens for detailed attention. Now, what this means in English is something like a 128K context window will have its computational cost reduced by over 98%. And as the context windows get bigger, the computational cost savings get even better. So now this is still an experimental model, but what DeepSeek is saying so far is that you can use this mechanism and not get very much of a reduction in output quality at all. So hopefully something like coding models are really going to benefit by this because as you know with the coding models you need bigger and bigger context windows as your code base gets bigger. So this is a pretty exciting thing and let's hope it uh, continues to grow and it continues to bring computational costs down.